Just Drinking's back with a little Captain Morgan orange vanilla twist. A little Captain. I guess we're emphasizing the little, <laughs> little, little captain. He is pretty small on the label. So little captain down here. Oh, sorry. It just struck me funny. I, I like it. I'm all good with it. So this is obviously the new one. This is new wear um, for Captain Shelves. We've seen it out here. It's their summer edition for the orange vanilla twist. Yep. And I believe it's going to be about exactly what it says. I mean, I mean, it's orange vanilla twist. No story. It's a traditional Captain Morgan bottle. It's got, you know, just uh, their regular slick bottle that you'd see any of their products in. It's exactly what you're going to get. It's just got yep. that nice orange and white stripe. Yep. Sounds good. All right. We're going to crack this baby open for the first time and just see Yeah, I've see not how she had goes. this. You haven't had nope, it. Nope. This is a brand new <laughs> bottle. And so we decided it was high time we try it. Oh, yeah. We got to try it. It looks interesting now that we're finally in warm months. <laughs> yeah. Summer I, is just around the corner. Feels good. So we're going to get in that nice. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Everybody catch that sound? Oh, man. That was. That was beautiful. Wow, I just mean, a beautiful sound. Just, does it get any Making better? Me thirsty. It's got a pretty light color to it. It is light. It comes out a little bit lighter. It's interesting how much lighter. I wasn't expecting that. Oh wow. It's very orangey. And vanilla. And vanilla. I, I mean, both that, both I, flavors are I, the same. I think they nailed the, the name. label. They did. It's they like nailed they, it. It's like they knew what it was going to be. <laughs> wow. They're getting good at this. They've been around for a little while, I guess. <laughs> this is a 30% 60 proof. Um, so a little bit lower than Captain. Um, and even a little bit, you know, Captain's yeah. already a little bit on the low half. And so this is even a little bit lower. So we're at 30% 60 proof. Um, so I imagine this is probably going to be a little more flavory. Yep. Be my a little guess. bit more for your foo foo drinks. A little more for right? the foo foo drinks. Summer edition, summer, summer drinks. Edition. So it'll be it'll be interesting. Okay. Let's get a sip here and see yeah. how it goes. Here we go. It's orange and vanilla, but it's almost it almost seems like cheap orange vanilla. It, like it. <laughs> like it's like Captain Morgan. If you had regular Captain Morgan and you literally squeezed a little bit of orange into your glass and added a dash of vanilla. Yeah. I mean that's literally what it is. It just that the Captain flavor is still very heavy in this drink with a slight orange. Vanilla it, flavor over top of it. It reminds me of that really super, super cheap uh, orange, uh, icy, you know, those, uh, oh, God, what are they called? The uh, the freezer pops. Freezer pops. Yeah, the freezer pops. Are those like the push-ups? Like, is that what you're talking yeah, about? Yeah, no. Like the plastic? No. Well, no, I what mean, are you? Yeah, yeah, they had the, pops? the plastic. Yeah, just freeze, freezer pops. Just a really super cheap orange freezer pop yeah is and what i mean it tastes like. i mean it's just it's they definitely the thing that i'm thinking is that they just took their original recipe and i feel like they just added a dash of orange and vanilla i really yeah. don't think this is super creative just no. being fully honest with yep. you guys yep. it's it's not super creative and they did not reinvent anything here to, to remind everybody this is just our opinion so, yes, this is just our opinions, and we That's always it. tell you at the end of every review to go try it for yourself because regardless of what we think of it, you may we like know it what you think. better than we do. But we're just going to tell you our honest opinion yep. right here, right now. I think it, and I love Captain. I know, I said it. I said it. Oh, man, I die say it. And I know I'm going to get, I have a few people that we're friends with that I know are going to give me some, some crap for that one. But <laughs> I, you know I what? I am not a big fan of Captain. But you know what? I do, I do appreciate Captain, the different products they put out. This one here, though, does not reinvent the wheel. So let's put down this shot. All right. Let's get the All rest right. of the way through this Come review. Come on. It's almost better to drink it faster. It is. You get it. more flavor if you drink it. I like it sharper. Like, drink it fast. Yeah. Shoot it or mix it into something. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. Speaking of that, I'm ready to mix it up. All right, we're gonna try this, and obviously, this is not a traditional one that we'd recommend into a regular <laughs> diet pop. Um, maybe try some Seven Ups, uh, Sprite, you know, yeah, Sunkissed. Oh uh, yeah, Sunkissed sun would, would be great. Be good. Um, you could probably find a lot of better options, but to keep it like we usually do, we're just gonna mix it with the same stuff we always yeah. do and tell you how to go into a diet pop. Yep. I met somebody the other day. Wow, you. Are making new wow, friends. I, I just, I you just, know, I really fell right into that. I'm so didn't I? proud of you. Yeah. Well, did yeah. did you have to go outside, or was this your mailman coming to your house and <laughs> dropping stuff off? Because you know they really don't like to stop and be talked to. <laughs> that restraining order does keep me away. <laughs> uh, no, I was I was talking with somebody the other day about uh, some different rums. Okay. And he told me. Now this was the first time I had ever heard this. Is that he always enjoyed a good rum mixed with orange juice. Orange juice. So he always mixed his rum with orange juice. That's very interesting. You, you know, know, I don't hear that very typically. There are, we the, have. I've uh, heard it a few times. You know, Naked in Jamaica is yep. built for orange juice. You know, there are rums made for orange juice, yep. but I don't typically see most rums going orange juice, but I guess I could see how some people would like it. So I'm wondering if this would be a good one. For orange juice? For orange juice. It'd be an interesting try. This would be you an know, interesting try into orange well, juice. Well, somebody out there try it. 
Let us know what you think. And if it goes well, we'll try it too. <laughs> yeah, but be honest. Be we, honest with us. We might we might have to try that one out. I don't yeah. know. It's an interesting take. Let's get into this one. Okay. Actually blends pretty well. Yeah, it's okay. It's kind of I mean, like because like Coke comes out with like they have an orange Coke, don't they? They, yes. they have yes. you know it's kind of like that a little bit. It just yep. puts that orange spin on it. Uh, it does take the rum flavor out as soon as it hits the pop, and you a have bit. Yep. more of the orange vanilla pulls out, and yep. so. You want to go, if you're mixing into something like this, I probably wouldn't go too heavy. I don't know if it would mix well very far. Um, I do think it's meant for maybe some other drinks, but I think you could mix it into a lot of different pops. Sunkiss, 7-Up, this is just fine too. Um, yeah. You know, I think I think it could mix well. I think it has good mixability. What's the price point on this? This one actually comes out uh, to, uh, again, another standard Captain Morgan price range of around 18 bucks. Oh, um, really? 18, 20 bucks. That's not um, bad. Falling, falling right into that range. So you're going to find this one for a typical Captain Morgan price. And again, it's their summer edition, so um, probably limited. I'm sure they'll have it for a certain amount of time, and depending on how it goes, probably they may bring it back. Probably until summer's over. Maybe, <laughs> maybe. I'm guessing. I don't know. They can be crazy. <laughs> yeah. Let's rate this puppy. Okay. Bottling. Bam. 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 Bottling. Five. Five out of ten. Five. You know what? I'm going to give this bottling a 6 out of 10 for the simple what? fact what? that, yes, it's an average Captain bottle, but look at the orange and white stripes, oh, guys. Come, come on. on. That's, that's like and, worth and a point one the best part best. of the, Here's the whole point. Here's where it comes from. It's not even the orange and white little stripes. little captain? No, are you ready? <laughs> the captain is in a Hawaiian shirt. Is he really? Yes, I, he I is. Didn't even yep. That. So that makes it way cooler. I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10 for creativity <laughs> on the wow. bottle. For a shot on its own. Yeah. Sipping it. Four. Four out of 10? Four. You know... I'm actually, you know, it's flavored. I definitely think you want to shoot it. Don't sip it. It's not really a sipper. It, it's just something if you want to throw it back, you can. But I don't really think this is built to be on its own. Yeah. I am actually going to agree with the 4 out of 10. Which wow. is, again, that does not, happen very not often. typical of especially. me, especially with a sweet type of rum like this. But I yep. do think uh, I'd rather just have a regular Captain, which just bumps into that 5-6 range a regular Captain does. Regular vanilla ice cream. I mean. Uh. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> But you know, I, I do think that this is this has just got a weird tang to it on its own. I could shoot it, it; it's a little better. But four four to five out of ten, I think okay. it lands in. Okay, as a mixed drink. As a mixed drink, I am actually going to bump it up a pretty good chunk here on the scale because I do think that it mixed quite well. I think it has great mixability for different drinks other than what we had here. I'm going to give the mixability of this one, and I'm going to strike it to a seven out of ten. Wow. Yeah. So I'm going to get into the real upper half of the wow. scale here because I do think this is a fun mixable drink. Um, it is it is a 30% uh, 60 proof, you know, so it's a little bit lower, but I think I think it should mix well into a lot of different I, stuff. I agree. It's I a think, fun mixer. I think it's possible that uh, it will mix well with other, you know, drinks along the fruit flavor range. Yeah. But uh, just because of that, I, I'm going by what what I tasted here. I'm looking at, I'm going to go with six. <laughs> six out of ten. Six. I mean, it's a step up above the and vanilla ice cream that they usually toss and out And you know, I, I totally expect that from you because you really don't like sweet flavored drinks. It's I really not don't. really your thing. You like no. spiced rum more than anything. Oh, yeah. So when you get into flavored stuff, Spicier that's more flavor. up my alley. Yeah, um, I agree. I, I like the, the stuff that's flavored, smooth, all that different yep. stuff. I love that stuff. And, and when we're doing a spiced rum, you're usually on the lower end of yeah. the scale. I'm usually on the higher end of the scale. So, so, you know, someone who likes this kind of thing, and even someone who doesn't, I think this has oh, great, it's, great potential. It's worth a try. Definitely. You know, absolutely. You know, pick up a bottle, tell us what you think. Well, geez, don't be so pushy. Gosh. I am. Do it. Man. Do it today. <laughs> that is Captain Morgan Orange Vanilla Twist, the summer edition. Make sure you guys check your local liquor stores. Make sure you go out, request it in, find yourself a bottle, try it for yourself, and let us know in the comments what you think, and uh, check it out for yourself today. And if you guys think that the captain looks way better in this vacation shirt than he typically does, make sure you guys subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit the like button, make sure that you check into our videos every single week because we're always putting out new videos for you guys, doing all kinds of weird stuff. We're starting to we're expand, doing it for you. expand on what we're doing, um, so we're very excited to be on this show and we love having you guys here. And comment uh, rums that you think we should try, what you think of the rums we're trying, and we just want to hear from you guys. We so really do. That's all, that's all from us, and Royer, let's get them home safe. Always. Drink responsibly, never drink and drive, and no rums were harmed during the making of this video. Not at all. We'll see you next time, guys. Take care.